We got some stuff we need to talk about. Let's just go ahead and get started right now. We put in something in our goodbye rule search. It may not show up because of how I did it. Because it may not like all the colons and everything. But I think we're going to be aight. Ladies and gentlemen, federal tax credits come from the federal government. As explained before, tax credits can only come from government. Tax credits cannot come from an individual. They can be transferred once received from the federal government, but they do not come from an individual. Individuals have to receive it from the federal government first before they can transfer it, sell it, or give it to someone else. Got it? That's interesting. Because what I'm pulling up here, and I can't pull it up with this one, so I'm going to have to go to this one. You're going to go to this one? I'm going to go to this one. Why don't you go to that one? Because that one is at the gap, and somebody fell into it. Oh, okay. So, sorry, ladies and gentlemen. Fall into the gap. That's why they fell into it. All right, we're going to put it here, because sometimes the algorithm doesn't like Google's partner, Gabiru, to take you to locations. So we have to go to other browsers. And so in this browser, we are using a different search engine. It's called Ecosia. E-C-O-S-I-A. It is a search engine. It's comparable to Gabiru. So I don't get all those searches because I did that earlier today. Went to a Google search and we were looking for days because somebody got something from the IRS. And I will talk to you guys about that at another time. But it actually showed a charge off on his account that he knew nothing about. The bank never sent it to him. But it showed with the charge off that there was a 1099C cancellation of debt associated with it. I'll be showing you guys that information soon. But not now okay let me get rid of that now I will have some music in my background because it's my background okay mine and while we do that I'm gonna put you guys on pause there will be music when I come back oh it, it we don't even have to worry about coming back look government obligations B obligations that are back come on Bobby let them know he wants y'all to know that he's on, ow, on, oh, come on, heart and soul, dance, you guys remember Bobby Brown when he had heart and soul, the dancers, yeah, one of the first ones to do that, okay, he got his own dancers, gave him a name, heart and soul, okay, that was Bobby Brown, Bob, 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 Bob Brown, y'all, that was Bob Brown, Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I want y'all to pay attention to this. Obligations that are backed by the full faith and credit of any state or United States government. I want y'all to pay attention because many of y'all don't pay attention. This is an actual code that we put in here. Okay? Okay? Okay! Ladies and gentlemen, what you all need to understand is that tax credits are government obligations. They're backed by the full faith and credit of the United States government. This is Article 4, Section 1, Full Faith and Credit Clause. Tax credits come from the United States government. Do you understand what's going on here when we talk about you all should be going after your tax credits because they are backed by the full faith and credit of the United States government? Okay? Okay? So, let me... Uh, Make sure y'all understand. Come on, that was Al Pacino. Okay? Okay? Know what I'm saying? Sorry. He found out that nothing is given. Let's get rid of that right there. And let's give him my three dots again. Now get on out of here. Get on, ah, uh, on. Oh, and I guess we're gonna have to take you guys know that this is from the ghostbuster album right that stupid ghostbuster movie yeah government obligation means any security that is or a direct obligation of the united states of america to which the full faith and credit of the united states of america is pledged tax credits ladies and gentlemen 
an obligation of a person controlled or supervised by or acting as an agency or an instrumentality of the United States of America, or the payment of which, blah, blah, blah. Government obligations, ladies and gentlemen. Federally guaranteed obligations are debt securities issued by the United States government, tax credits, ladies and gentlemen, and considered risk-free because they receive the full faith and credit of the federal government. Tax credits, ladies and gentlemen. Pay attention. See? Ghostbusters. All right. Full faith and tax credits. Credit of the United States government. Y'all need to pay attention. That's what we're doing here. That's what we're talking about. That's what I was doing. So while they were putting me on ice and sitting up there and trying to make me not have access to anything and trying to take away freedom, I was being patient. Okay? I was being patient. Why? Because this is what I was going for, ladies and gentlemen. I just needed time to go by. So when they don't respond to you, when they don't respond to your affidavits, when they don't respond to you, when they have an obligation to respond, and we have put the case law, case law up there, for you guys to know about a duty to respond, go to the PDF section, type in duty to respond in the search bar, and see what you get. Because we have a whole packet, duty to respond. Okay? They have a duty to respond, and they don't respond, they're in default. They're in default, arbitration, the arbitrator only has one choice. Only one choice. Are they in default or are they not in default? Sorry, Charlie. And then you wait. Six months after the award is issued. Guess what, ladies and gentlemen? Six months. And it becomes an automatic tax credit. Get it done, people. That's what the arbitration contracts are for. Get it done before they change the law. To try to stop y'all from doing what y'all doing. Okay? Payment is backed by the full faith credit of the United States government. See treasury bills. They are... Callable at any time at par treasury bills are original. Ladies and gentlemen, full faith and credit. Y'all need to pay attention. Okay. What you need to understand is that this declares that these materials should receive the same full faith and credit in each state as in the state in which they were taken, the United States of America. Tax credits are dollar for dollar. They are guaranteed. Okay? Just that simple. Just so y'all know. So, this is what we're doing. Don't care about nobody's marriages. Sorry, y'all. Don't care about no child support. No, we can go all the way back up. Because... We are going to do, this is what I need to copy. This is what y'all need to understand. Credit. It's always been about credit people in the United States. Has not been about dollar bills. It's always been about credit because the credit comes from where? Credit comes from the people. Full faith and credit, people. Pay attention. Look, I got to go. Less than nine minutes just to bring y'all this information because I hope y'all going to pay attention. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go.